By stepping in front of his foot, you can trip him when you push his arm down. This locks his leg, so he cannot step forward to regain his balance. To counter your opponent grabbing your wrist with both of his hands from behind, react as if he only grabbed you with his opposite hand. Press the back of his hand to his forearm as you step in and push his elbow up. To take down your opponent from this position, step behind his leg. Raise his elbow as you press down on his hand to upset his balance. Push him backwards across your leg. To counter this technique, reach underneath your opponent's elbow as he attempts to raise your elbow. Press his elbow up, then over as you control his wrist with your other forearm. Press his palm into your body with your forearm, locking his wrist. Push his elbow down, sinking with him to take him down. Follow the momentum of his arm twist attempt to switch control from one of his arms to the other. Control his forearm by the wrist and elbow. In this variation, pivot and grab his wrist with your grasped hand. Place your free hand under his chin and push up to hyperextend his neck. Wrap your grasped hand around your body so that it is by your hip. Pull his wrist using your whole body. To counter this technique, maintain your grip on his hand and intercept his hand as he reaches for your chin. Extend his attacking hand, crossing his arms behind his back. Maintain your grip on his same hand instead of letting him grab your opposite hand. Hyperextend his attacking arm by turning his palm away from his body and pressing his elbow across his other wrist. Follow the momentum of your opponent's attempt to pivot out by continuing his arm movement until it is hyperextended. In this variation, your opponent maintains his grip on your opposite hand. Cover your chin with your free forearm and extend his arm as in the previous technique. Intercept his attacking hand by pushing his forearm aside with your forearm. Hyperextend his elbow or his shoulder. In this variation, grab your opponent's wrist and pivot. Strike just above his elbow with your free forearm. Press down on his upper arm to take him down. Keeping his wrist at the center of your back, lock his arm by pressing down with your wrist and forearm. In this variation, grab your opponent's wrist and pivot. Bring your free arm under his elbow and grab above his shoulder. Hyperextend his elbow. Control his arm at his wrist and shoulder. Hyperextend his elbow across your upper arm. In this variation, instead of pushing his shoulder back, pull his shoulder forward to take him down. Pull his wrist as you turn so that you maintain the hyperextension of his arm. Your whole body locks his arm. To counter either of the last two variations, intercept your opponent's free hand as he reaches under your arm. Maintain your grip on his other hand. Raise his wrist up as you press down just above his elbow. Pivot with your opponent, constantly pressing down on his shoulder and lifting his wrist. Hyperextend both his shoulder and his elbow.
To counter your opponent grabbing both of your wrists from behind, grab one of his wrists, pivot, and twist his arm. Cross his arms, trapping his other arm under your grabbing arm, between your upper arm and your torso. This arm is trapped by both your arm and your opponent's own twisted arm. By twisting his arms around each other, you can upset your opponent's balance. Lean your body into your opponent's body to push him down. As you turn, extend your opponent's fingers to break his grip. Maintain contact to establish a grip on his wrist and twist. Sink your elbow to trap his other hand, leaning into him with your body. Pivot and push his shoulder down with your other hand, while maintaining the twist on his arm. Bring the hand of his twisted arm up to his shoulder. Follow the momentum of your pivot to get behind your opponent so that you can push his shoulder down before he frees his arm. Once you have his shoulder, focus on that arm twist. To counter this technique, follow his momentum to pivot in, jamming his attempt to grab your wrist. Maintain your grip on his other hand, pulling it behind his back. Push his arms together using your upper arm, crossing them behind his back. Pull him backwards to take him down. In this variation, lean forward to raise your wrist to break his grips. Turn and step behind and hook his leg with yours. Push his upper body across your leg with your arm to take him down. Grab both of his upper arms as he goes down. Squeeze his elbows together to maintain control of his arms. Lean forward to loosen your opponent's grips, then turn to completely free your wrists. Follow your opponent's arms up for the push. Hook his legs so he cannot step back to regain his balance. To counter your opponent grabbing your upper arm, grab his hand with your free hand and pin it to your arm. Circle your grabbed arm over, then down to hyperflex his wrist. In this variation, grab your opponent's hand and twist his arm so his palm faces up. Press his palm towards his forearm. Use your grabbed arm to press down on the elbow, locking his whole arm. To take him down, bring his forearm to the ground with his fingers twisted up. To counter this technique, intercept your opponent's wrist as he attempts to grab your elbow. Straighten his arm and hyperextend his elbow. Fold your arm, trapping his upper arm under your armpit, while twisting his palm so that it faces up, bear down on your shoulder with your body. Fold your arm before your opponent fully straightens it. His grip will loosen when you hyperextend his other arm. Follow your opponent's momentum, turning with his attempt to twist your arm. In this variation, swing your grabbed arm over his forearm and grab his elbow. Trap his hand in your armpit and push his elbow up. To counter your opponent grabbing your upper arm from behind, swing your arm around to push his elbow up. Use your free hand to push his upper body, upsetting his balance. Sink down with your opponent as he falls. Press his shoulder to the ground while keeping his elbow locked.
To counter this technique, change your grasp from his upper arm to his wrist. Place your other hand under his elbow and push up. Pull his hand to his shoulder to lock his arm. Push his elbow back to take him down. In this variation, the hand positions reverse. The action in the arm lock is the same. Pivot your body so that your movement is minimal as your opponent is pulled off balance. Hyperflex his elbow while you press his elbow past his shoulder. 